Eleganza once again. Shade Chocolate. It might be the deepest shade. I don't really remember. And I'm using my Sephora Pro angle brush. Like I said, the brush is discontinued, but any angle brush will do. I'm just kind of blending it in because I kind of made a little mistake right here. So we blended her in. But so far, I'm not mad about these bronzers. I'm just going to go over it with a beauty blender. I think it looks good. I think it looks really, really, really good. Warm up around my hairline. Well, not even my hand on my forehead, actually. And this bronzing and stuff, it'll just help kind of balance out your foundation. So, yeah. I'm blending it in, y'all. We blended her in. I love cream products, may I say. Now, I will say, I'm not sure how this will be in the sun. That'll be like the test. To see how the products like behave in the sun but i'm gonna go in my chin and like around because i just want to get more of that tan effect just because my foundation all right so now i'm gonna go in and contour my nose with the bronzer let's see how it how it will be so I have a cream shadow brush and I have some bronzer on it and I'm just going to contour my nose. So clearly I am using my bronzer for more of a contour, but you can use your bronzer for whatever you want. And I will say that is blending actually really good. So it's blending really good. I I like it, to be honest. I think it's really bomb. It's not drying too fast, but it's not too creamy. It doesn't feel oily or greasy on my face. It feels actually really good. So I'm going to take a little bit of the LA Girl Concealer and just bring it down the middle of my nose. And I'm just going to blend it in. Very natural. So I think this is really good for the girl who wants to contour, who wants to be bronze, who wants something quick. I did go ahead and just add some translucent powder underneath my bronzer. I'm pushing it in my skin because I don't want to rub it or it's going to basically make my makeup come off. So we're going to push right here. It's kind of small in my opinion, but I mean, you don't use a lot of blush. So I'm guessing you, I'm guessing honestly, you don't need a lot. But the shade I got is Rose Latte. I'm sorry for all the noise, y'all. Oh, this is cute. This is so cute. I'm honestly picking up a little bit more than what I would normally wear. Because it's cream and I know it's going to melt in my skin. You know, I feel like I can go a little crazy. My thoughts on the blush. I really like the blush. Oh, my God. Like... This all together, this looks so good. This is like my type of color. It's good, y'all. It even has a little sheen. So it kind of gives you like that natural glow, if you want to say. So I'm here for it. And once again, the blush color is called Rose Latte. It looks like this. It's small. It is definitely small, but honestly, you don't need a lot. I'm trying to look at the finish if it says... But it doesn't say, but it's a cream finish. So it's kind of like a sheen, I would guess. It's like the finish. But you don't need a lot. This is how mine looks after I use it. Use synthetic brushes for liquids and creams. It picks it up. It goes on so good. It's cute. It's super cute. All right, so we're going to go in now with the Yeah, So Cognac can see looks like this. This is freaking beautiful. I'm going to go in with my Makeup Forever fan brush. And so we are going to apply her. We are going to apply her. I want to be glowing. I'm going for a nice glow. Look at that. Tell me she isn't cute. And it's like, oh, this is freaking, it's fire. This is what you want, ladies. This is what you want. I'm going to even put some on my shoulders. 
Give a little shoulder action. Look at that. Look at her on the shoulders. Like, yes, bitch. Yes. Okay. Dance with her shoulder. I'm going to be a little struggling on this side, but whatever. Now lip paint in the shade Unbutton. No, I'm sorry. Not Unbutton. Uncuffed. In the Fenty Sun and Lip Paint in the shade Uncuffed. And we're going to apply. And then I like to rub my lips together. And then I'm going to show y'all how I basically blend it out with a lip brush. Alright, so I get my lip brush and I just basically diffuse it all in there. Like, if you know me, I love a sexy lip. Like, that is my vibe. It has to be super pouty. Just very, like, very sexy, very luscious. And now we're going to go in with our gloss balm in the shade Hot Chocolate. And we're going to add just a little bit. Because, I honestly, I love how this looks. But I'm just going to add a teeny tiny bit right in the center. You can even like diffuse it in the center if you want. All right, so basically, this needs these products the bronzer, contour, whatever. The contour is super nice, it's very subtle, it's not too much going on. The payoff is super nice, very easy, very creamy, and very built. Basically, the bar, um, the bronzer, amazing, it's really good, super buildable, it's not hard to use. I feel like that's definitely you need it. Um, the highlight. Do y'all see this? I just I did spray my face with setting spray, but honestly, even without it, it still gave you that very like that wet glazed donut type of look. So the highlight is an absolute. Add it in your cart now. You will not regret it. You need it. Um, the blush I think is very pretty, but. I feel like you could definitely pass on a blush. It's not, like, really a necessity. Me, I do love it. So, I think the blush is cute. I feel like if you're a blush kind of girl, then you need it. But if you're not, like, blush is not really your thing, you don't need it. You could probably, like, pass on it. But I'm going to add a little bit more. More blush just to kind of build it up. But you know what, though? For um my more mature ladies that like blush but they don't want it too crazy and too loud, I think this shade Rose Latte, amazing. Like me, Rose Latte, honestly, this is gonna be my go-to blush color. It also doesn't make you too greasy because you know creams tend to be like very greasy. I will say um once the weather gets very hot, maybe just set your face because keep in mind it is cream and cream is going to give you moisture, so it may not last how you want to but i'm not too sure it's not that hot today so i don't really know it's a 10 out of 10 you need the products add the products try them out you won't regret it like i said this is all fancy on my face i have fancy foundation i have on the bronzer i have the cream blush and i have the highlight as well i had the powder bronzer too but i kind of broke mine so i couldn't put it on but if you don't like cream the powder bronzer is amazing you need that too it's super fire especially if you're a woman of color fenty honestly needs to be your go-to brand because you know it's it's for us it's rihanna made this really for us so we could feel you know welcome in the beauty industry but until then i will see y'all on the next one comment and like if you enjoy these type of videos on instagram or let me know if you think i should go back to youtube and so then see you later High fashion, like Goya, G-Wagon, or the Rover. I put some ice on you cause...